It is 338 BC, and relations between the cities of Greece and the Kingdom of Macedon are broken down. Philip, King of Macedon, is on the move south, a means to bring the cities of Athens and Thebes to heel. Assembled against him on the plains of Chironia are the combined forces of the Athenian and Theban armies. Among their numbers are the dreaded Theban sacred band, an elite corps of 300 spearmen. Philip knows that their very presence on the battlefield will strike terror into the hearts of his men. But Philip has a secret weapon of his own. He is joined on his march by his son Alexander, commanding the elite Macedonian cavalry. Alexander is young in age, but exceptional in personal courage and ability. The cavalry under his command will be key today in finding victory. Philip knows that the Thebans will have to be neutralized and quickly if his men are to find the necessary resolve to hold back the Greek phalanx. The plan is for Philip to engage the main Greek line with the Macedonian phalanx. At the same time, Alexander will lead his cavalry against the three sacred band units by the river. Should Alexander fail to neutralize the Thebans or wander from his objective, the Macedonian army will likely be overcome. Alexander must find a way to defeat the sacred band with his cavalry if his father and country are to taste victory today. Take heart from your success against the Sacred Band, for there are two more. The rout of the greater part of the Sacred Band is a your complete destruction of the Sacred Band has been watched with delight by our Macedonian comrades. The famously invincible vanguard of the Theban army has been annihilated in a day, but that day is not over. There are still enemies on the field, so go to the aid of your countrymen.
enemy show their true virtue. They are not soldiers, only frightened rabbits running from our men. This is a day of glorious victory. The enemy fought well, but not well enough.